getting a little bit picky. This is this is knowing you need to make the whistle. Not only a rough landing, but it could be a rough send send off for Sean Willingham. For all intents and purposes, he will have to now go back down to the minor leagues and work his way up. Yeah, and he starts a really good ride on. This is just a great long round bull to have to, to put in a solid score. And Willingham's doing pretty darn good, but as soon as he gets a little bit back, you see his foot coming up, but that's okay, because it comes back down, touches him right there, and watch his head. Head comes up, he's going out, bull's still going left. That That's just being a little too tight. It's a great little bull, should be round the right, right here. Oh! Nice job by our ride pass bullfighters, Cody Webster, part of that. Cody, that's tough right there, that's like a turtle on his back. You guys did an outstanding job moving in there. That was close there, Scott. That <laughs> was a little close. You're saying he wasn't mean or his game on. <laughs> Man, Webster, Frank Newsom, Shorty Gorham. Great little bull just leaps and cracks. Uh, Dakota Butter just really let one slide by him right there. That bull's got to have a seat on him. And if he had overs, I bet he rides him nine out of 10 more times. Well, when they, when they fit him and he's in that click, man, this is a guy that looks pretty good doing it. And he's going to give out the effort every single time. Cole Livingston not able to make his first round work here. Skyfall gets him down and watch this replay. He just dives way over in there too far, but then he tries to come out. And you hear a lot of old bull riders say that the hardest moving bull riders to make is when you get in there too far is to reach out over that bull's hump and to come back to center and stop without going too far. And, and uh, Cole Livingston's guilty of it right there. This is a good one to have in this rerun. Boy, this is the right one here. he wants right here in the door of the left. Got good time and good speed. That place higher win the go around. Oh! Nope. That bull does that to a lot of guys, though. And wasted him. Mm. I wish I had a dollar for everyone I wasted just like that, Silvano. I know how you feel. <laughs> But you just slide down there too deep because you're overexcited about it, and then you got to come out and you reach across there and you go too far and you touch him. It just nightmare come true right there. What a great one to have in that re-ride pin. Silvano Alves not able to keep his winning ways here into tonight. So another member of Team USA in a week there to help him. You want to see, hear, and even feel what this sport is like? We got it all as Outlaw got thrown back at our camera crew. Yeah, you want to know how tough professional bull riding is? Watch this back. Night Sweats dispatches Outlaw with prejudice. And this bull's got some stuff to him right around the corner. And Outlaw, a guy that's kind of nursing a sore neck from a week ago. And Man, let's listen. Night sweats turned Chase Outlaw into a 150 pound frisbee as he went flying back into the steel. The bull score 33 and three quarters, and 